Well, the sign says it all. The Derby Dog Pound is now closed after some very disturbing allegations and the animal control officer suddenly walking off the job. Six dogs were being held here at the Coon Hollow facility in Derby, but on Friday, animal control officer Joe Klapsick up and left, leaving no one to care for them. <laughs> Woodbridge has now stepped in. They are housing and feeding all six, but they already have their own dogs to care for, and they are almost at capacity now. Derby police tell us people with animal problems should still call police, but Woodbridge may be called in to respond. Anthony Pisanelli, out with his Chihuahua chocolate, says he prefers to have someone in town. Oh, yeah. The nearest local one is either Shelton or Ansonia. I don't know why they would go to Woodbridge with Shelton and Ansonia, like right next door. Yeah. Kind of like weird. The whole thing is a bit weird. According to the Valley Independent Sentinel, Klapsick, the animal control officer, told the city he would leave at the end of the month, but up and left Friday instead. And we're told these dogs were apparently living in conditions that were not the best. No. Feces in the cages, you know, just, it wasn't all that great. Ellen Kemp used to bring her six-year-old daughter Laura to visit the dogs, but wasn't happy with the place or the way they were being treated. Last year, the Valley Independent Sentinel launched an investigation, finding there was a 50% kill rate. Some months, it was as much as 80%, one of the highest in the state. The kill rate has now decreased dramatically, but many in town tell us the conditions are still not good. Volunteers from Oxford were brought in this weekend to clean up, and again, the dogs are now bunking with their buddies in Woodbridge. It is not clear yet if this is all permanent. Oh, wow, that's far. And a lot of people around here don't have cars to be able to go and adopt, and that's so sad because there are a lot of animals that need a home. If you'd like to help out, Woodbridge Animal Control is taking donations. You can go to our website, WTNH.com, and of course, all of those dogs still need to be adopted. On the scene in Derby, Annie Rourke, News 8.